Hi beautiful people, it's Alabake Alase here again. It's been a while, I've been so busy, I've been so inconsistent with my videos. It's been so hectic with work and all. Promise to be a little more um, available for my channel. So today, can you guess what I'll be making today? That's tomatoes, green bell peppers and my onion. That's cow skin, tripe and chicken these are my spices the famous local spain from nigeria you don't really call that that's my thyme my salt and my curry so i'll be making ayamase sauce that's the ofada sauce so guys, I've blended my green bell peppers with my onion and my red habanero pepper. That gives you the hotness, that's the spice you need for ayamase sauce, see? And you cannot make ayamase sauce without palm oil, never, no, they don't go together. So, and locust bean, the most important component of ayamase because bean and your red palm oil and your of course your green bell peppers if i was back home in nigeria i would use the abonari pepper that is green not these green bell peppers so i'm just waiting for my pan to eat up before i put in my palm oil my locust bean and my onion yay So that's my locust bean and my onion. I'm just gonna cover it up for them to sizzle up and fry before I pour in my pepper. So we are indeed beginning to fry, to sizzle. I'm gonna pour my sauce in now so that they can continue the frying process together. Uh, in the UK, you cannot really. Uh, let your palm oil do so much on the fire otherwise your alarm is gonna blow and you know you don't want that so my pepper is gonna go in now Ooh, whoa, whoa. that's my sauce going on so it's gonna eat up and fry and simmer and look so yummy uh, the ayamase sauce, ofada sauce, is very indigenous to Nigerian people, the Yoruba to be precise. They eat it with this kind of brown rice, which is very healthy, and it's locally produced in Nigeria. You can eat with um, yam, potato, a rice, you know, do as you wish. That's my thing going on. You can't really bleach your palm oil because of your fire alarm systems here in the UK. If I was back home in Nigeria, believe me, I would bleach the palm oil to the very least. And just to enjoy the all the flavors the palm oil has. That's my Ayamase sauce sizzling, boiling and doing all of its yummy goodness in there. So guys, my ayamase sauce has been boiling for about um, 35 minutes now, just so the um, liquid content, the water in it would um, evaporate and I'll have just my seal and my um, oil floating on top, it's gradually coming through. I put in my um, tripe, my shark in it to get it a little softer. Beautiful people, can you see what I see? I wish you were in my kitchen, in my arm, everywhere is just seasoned for the aroma is overwhelming. Damn it. Even my neighbors can testify. It's coming apart. I found my spices and my, um, for more my cow skin. My tribe shark is in the glass room, so is my chicken. Okay, and usually. Bone eggs are I go to always in ayamase sauce. You cannot have ayamase sauce without boiled eggs, but I'm gonna be excluding the boiled eggs, anyways. 
it's it's really optional so whatever you like you can add into your yamate sauce ready and done done dusting yamate is all about the oil palm oil fresh fragrant redness